Yeah, what's going on? So today we got a video from the cop cam and the title of the video is traffic stop turns into a two million dollar uh i don't want to say the word but uh that white girl you know what i mean bust you know what i mean so youtube you know they real sensitive you know so i don't really want to uh, do anything to get them after me you know what i mean so let's go let's get into the video It's always them trucks. So some of you guys may not know much about uh, the trucking business. So he asked for a couple of things, right? So the first thing he asked for was the CDL, CDL license. Then he said, you know, what's who's who's back there? Because right behind the seats, there's like a sleeping area. So he said, oh, my friend or whatever, or team driver whatever whatever the excuse it's so noisy you can't really comprehend like what what they were saying right then and there but then he asked for um the bill of lading right so which is in the trucking industry is called a bol so well that's what it's called for short but it stands for bill of lading which the information that would have on there is where he picked it up what freight he's supposed to have so that's why he asked him what's in the what's in the trailer so you know not everybody owns 
the truck in the trailer. When you buy a truck, it's not the whole thing, right? It's only the front half. A trailer is the long piece in the back. That you could buy separate. You know, a lot of people either buy separate or they rent it or whatever the case may be, right? So now, anyways, so the the paper, the BOL is going to have what freight he's supposed to have. So I'm pretty sure now he's going to verify if that stuff is in the back, right? So this is kind of where we're leading up to. So now he has the paper, seeing what's on there. And he also asks for the logs. So they're supposed to log um, different information, like uh, where they're going or whatever. Like it's either paper logs or they do a digital or whatever, but they're saying that they don't have no logs at all. And that's supposed to be, you're supposed to have that. So it's, it's getting, uh, it's getting pretty hectic. He's definitely going to uh, start searching. You have one you can fill out right now? Mm -hmm. You have a logbook you can fill out? Yeah, yeah. I have the uh, no. Well, let me see. Do you stay in Phoenix for five days? At the truck stop? Yeah, at the truck stop. Can you get a load? The weekend. Okay. All right. Let's check all the lights. Thank you. I'm gonna check that power signature. DOT inspection. Now he's gonna make sure and see if he got everything that he's supposed to have in on the truck. I told you he was gonna it was gonna turn into, you know, he's gonna start checking some stuff. It's not tight. I can put my finger in there. Just the way your hand is. There you go. Good? We'll adjust them when somebody else gets here. You can put it on the You're twisting your... Huh? You can put it on the front. When somebody else gets here. Okay? Can I make a hand? Yeah, yeah. I got somebody coming. You guys can get up off the ground here in just a minute. We'll adjust the cups, okay? What is it? So I got somebody else coming. I need to read you your rights. 
You have the right, before we ask you any questions, you must understand your rights. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before we ask you any questions and to have him with you during questioning. If you can't afford a lawyer now, one will be appointed for you before any questioning if you wish. If you decide to answer questions now without a lawyer present, you still have the right to stop answering questions at any time. You also have the right to stop answering at any time until you talk to the lawyer. You understand your rights. I need to just hit yes or no. Yeah. I don't have a Spanish one, so we'll get you one later. My phone number, my phone, so I can make a call. Who you gonna call? Oh my god, this is it. Okay, I'll call it. And my baby mama. Your baby? Yeah, my baby mama. Is that right? You say your baby mama? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Maybe we'll do that in a little bit, okay? Alright. Could I smoke a cigarette real quick? Yeah, I'm waiting for the other guy to get here. He's about three minutes away. We're not trying to do nothing stupid. I hope no, not. We're, we're calling over you. We're chilling. Alright. That's it. Okay. Right. You want to talk to me about anything that's going on today? No. I don't know why you pull us over. Okay. Well, I do. I do uh, commercial vehicle inspections. That's why. That's why I stopped you guys. Okay. Uh, I'm. A, I'm gonna be up front. Looks like there's some drugs in the truck. Okay. So. Uh, I don't know if you guys want to cooperate with us or not. If you don't want to make any statements, that's fine. I don't know. So. Nope. Okay. Are you able to translate by asking something? Yeah. Okay. Ask him if he wants to cooperate with this investigation. Can you ask him that? He's like, like what? What, what do you want? Okay. We'll, we'll stop it there for now. I like weed in here, don't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Basically, these two boxes. It's right there. Now it's covered up like this. So I'll take a couple pictures of that. You still use your camera? Yeah. It does smell like weed in here. Mm -hmm. Got some big bricks. Grab one, I'll grab the other. Where's the other box at? Okay, cool. And I just want to say that it's very common for um, this to be going on, like this whole operation. They use truck drivers and stuff like that, you know, because a lot of times truck drivers don't really get stopped. But you do have DOT officers, Department of Transportation officers that they are trained to look for certain things or whatever. So. A lot of time they get caught up when they're just doing a random inspection. You know what I mean? And then that's why they keep questioning them and asking them. And, and once they find, oh, you ain't got something, something ain't adding up or it's not right or whatever. Okay. We're going to start searching.
tides are real cool. Is it tied through it? Yeah. So they pull that out somewhere. See right there? They shoved that in there. I'll have to look real real quick. Uh, a lot of times you'll see these in the uh, axle, uh, not axle compartments, but the uh, uh, sidewalk compartments. And they're, they're, I'll show you where they gain access to it. So they just stuff all in there and leave the rope where they can pull back up. Mm -hmm. So 20 kilos. When I get in the mood No time for the fakes When you see me I see you No FaceTime Shoot my shot Green beam 2K shit that Get a nigga lean